On the 10th of the 2022, met the people tour, President Barrow finishes his nationwide tour in the rural Gambia as he embarks on site visits of projects under development. On Wednesday, November 30th, Barrow visits the Tivet Center in Mansa, Congo, where trainees create beds, bicycles, concrete mixes, solar installations, donkey carts, and other materials which are marketable. After his side visit, the president engaged the members of the press. The, the skill gap in the Gambia is very, very big. We have to move faster. We have to be committed. We have to make sure we train our people who will be ready for the market. And with these innovative ideas, I think the sky is the limit. Government is there to give support. Moreover, the president proceeds to the Farawa Bantang University campus, where extension of the tertiary institution is on the working process. In an engagement with reporters, the president highlights the importance of the institution and says the inadequate space warrants the extension of the institution to enable students with effective lectures. Structural development is key and is important. It creates the environment, a conducive environment for the students and for the teachers. And this is the permanent home of the University of the Gambia. We are having problem of space. Now we are creating enough space for the students. Further, the president was later welcomed along the highways where some supporters showed their solidarity. In his concluding interview with the press at the State House, Barrow expresses delights after completing his tour in the rural Gambia, which he believes was a fruitful dialogue between his government and the Gambian people, stating that they were able to put the message across and the people have admitted to his government's efforts. Likewise, some challenges were also outlined in which his government's continuing progress will ease difficulties of livelihoods. Basiruka for N24 News. <laughs>